Hello YouTube, welcome to another episode of Super Mario Bros. X. I am Morquez and my voice may be really clear because this is my new experiment with my commentary. Alright, last time we started this place, I forget what it was called, and now we're up to Dire Dire Rocks. But guess where they got that name? No. Now... One thing I'm really curious about. I never knew that. Okay. If you press the special act special action, then you will get to um turn to stone. With Tanuki that is. I mean Okay, so this place looks like a big underwater maze. Luckily you don't run out of air at all in this level. All right. This level has the probably has a star and probably the easiest one too. All you have to do, but also probably the easiest and one of the longest taking. Why? It's getting all the red coins. So original. Red coins you can snag with the boomerang or Yoshi, which is unique for any kind of coin. Then again, I haven't exactly tried. Those air bubbles, instead of water in the air, they're air in water. So, but wherever you see a bubble, there's going to be a red coin. Now, the reason I do this as like Luigi and instead of, um, instead of, what's his, what's his name? Yeah, Toad or Link is because there's something in here that only the, do, only the Mario Brothers can get. But guess what that is? I mean... Let's see, what can only the Mario Brothers use? Hmm. Here's a hint. What I'm trying to chase. There you go, and... Yeah, there's a certain kind of special Yoshi. If you, so you would call it. In here. The best Yoshi in the game, actually. For the final level, I usually take a stop in here to get it. It's in that it's in that single egg down there lost Yoshi I don't give a darn but if I die I do give a darn so oh great this is going to be okay you know what this is going to take a while and I'm probably not going to have much to comment on so I'll speed this up, give you some good music for a change, as opposed to maybe something from my melee library, if you didn't know I had it. That's what you get when you try to download a melee ISO, either a copyright claim or a, um, what's it called, or run music album. I'll be right back.
Well, I lost Yoshi, but um, you brought me all the red coins. Please take a tr please take a treasure in my reward. You had a star. All right. I got a star and probably the best treasure in the game. I got all seven stars. I'm gonna give this to um Luigi. Well, why not? First of all, I'm going to give him the um, power-ups. I wonder if Toad and Peach can do that thing. Well, I'll find out, won't I? Alright, best power-up in the game. Lakitu's shoe is very special. It gives the wearer pow the power of flight. Yes, the final shoe. Lakitu's shoe. With that wing. You have infinite flight. No restrictions. But just like every shoe, it's useless under it's useless in water and goes away with one hit. Be very careful. I will probably be using this to spam the fi the final boss. But um enough of that. I'll find out that thing with them. You know, I'm going to, um... If you saw in my recording the black area, like right above the place where we saw that toad, um, that's the finish. So I'm going to... That's the finish. Just normal, clear the level. I'll be right back. Eeny, meeny, miny, mode. Kill marine life with the toad. Now that that's over with. Bubbles in the sky. Uh, I may have referenced this to this level before it appeared. I strongly recommend Peach. Those bubbles look pretty strong. I wonder if you could actually swim in them. No harm trying, except for the fact that they're over bottomless pits. And he just gave away way exactly how to clear the level by swimming in the bubbles. Wow. Even Nega Silver 63 could understand those kind of instructions. Alright, let's get let's get that switch. And it would give you a ground pound Yoshi, but since I can't do Yoshis, I'll be fine. Those blocks are really big help. But the shoes are not... Whoa, that was close. <laughs> wow, platforming skills are put to the test here. Oh, what could be in here? Or they could have, or those bubbles could have just not been over bottomless pits like I thought they were. Either works for me. What's up here? Ooh, another one of those mo th three life-giving moons. I just got mooned. Yay! Wow. Those things should give you should give you real Those Whoa those musical note blocks are really helpful if you if you didn't get those and from their position from the I'm at the blue bah! Will I just stop that? No I won't because it's commentary. Whatevs Alright, come on, bubble, work for me. That's what she said. Okay, that was freaky. They even alter your projectile's gravity. 
Gravity is infinite. Ugh. All right, after we've charred enough cheap cheeps, get another life for no reason. After only dying once, which is very good, we will move on to the next level. Or, or actually, I'll save that for the next episode because it will give you plenty of rage. It's a unique level all in its own. And you'll see why. So, this has been Morquez, and next time we will be covering The Invasion 4. We'll see you next time.